Hi there, wig lover. This is Heather from SisterWigs.com, and today I'm bringing you a re-review of the Sheila wig by Envy in the color Sparkling Champagne. Now, Sparkling Champagne is one of my absolute favorite Envy colors. This is a very beautiful, rooted, medium golden blonde with some very nice uh, light golden brown throughout. So, I'm revisiting this wig for one important reason. I think I wasn't very fair to it. Uh, I've had people come to me via email and tell me, hey, I love this wig. Why do you give it such a negative review? And I was like, well, hey, if all these people like it, perhaps I wasn't fair. Because when I first reviewed this wig, it was when I first started off in the wig reviews. I had a lot to learn still. And now that I've had some more perspective and I've reviewed literally hundreds of wigs, I thought maybe it's a good chance to give Sheila another chance and see how she looks, how she feels, and if my opinion of her has changed at all. So I'm gonna talk some specs real quick. Um, this is a completely open cap wig. I'm not gonna take her off just because she is completely machine made. She has permatees up here at the top, a little bit uh, more here at the crown, but the permatees on Sheila is actually fairly minimal um, because she's made to lay kind of sleek like a traditional bob. She weighs 3.1 ounces, which in my opinion is heavy for a wig of this length, um, but it's not oppressively heavy. The front is 4.5 inches, which to my mind should be swept off to the side. If you want to look like the manufacturer photo, you're going to have to trim it in most cases. Uh, the crown is 7.5 inches down. There you go. The sides are 4.75 inches, but that's just the topmost layer. And then the nape is four inches. So this is a nice, short, classic bob with a modified front. By modified front, I mean, it's got all this layering towards the front that's actually quite flattering on and helps modernize the look of Sheila a little bit. And in retrospect, I think that Sheila is a lot cuter on than I initially gave her credit for. I, I think that this one has grown on me <laughs> since my last review. I do think that this one's quite lovely. Um, though, I will say that because I have a large head, this one is kind of uncomfortable on me. It's, it's pinching and it's already starting to give me a headache. Um, so this one, it fits very true to size. If you have an average size head or even petite average, Sheila should fit you beautifully. However, I'm not in that category. So <laughs> for me personally, it's a little snug. Um, I will say that that perhaps is why my initial review of this was the way that it was. Um, you know, I'm not gonna negate my feelings about it, but I do wanna say that I was probably a little overwhelmed by the discomfort factor and it probably clouded my judgment. I think as far as quality is concerned and how this wig looks that this is an excellent piece especially for people starting out but only if you are true to size. So if you have anywhere from say like a 22 to a 22 and a half inch circumference this one will fit you very well. However mine's 23 and a half so I'm like yeah get it off get it off. But it's a beautiful wig, and so I definitely wanted to clarify that though this one may not, in fact, be for me without some modification, this one would be a great choice for anyone who has a true average head and wants something that looks like a classic, easy, shake-and-go short bob. So let me show you how this looks on all sides. So yes, I have reversed my opinion on Sheila. I think that she's an adorable wig. She's a bestseller. People love this wig. They really do. They love, love, love this wig. And so while I think that this one doesn't really fit me that well, it looks good on me. <laughs> and sometimes that's, you know, nine tenths of the battle. So until next time, this has been Heather from SisterWigs.com revisiting the Sheila wig by Envy in the color Sparkling Champagne. Thanks for watching. Check out my wig store if you get a chance. And see you later, Gator. Bye-bye.